Hey YouTube, um, just doing another update. I got some questions for test kits and stuff like that. Um, and my frog spawn here in the top right corner looks like it's kind of bleaching out on that first bulb. Um, if you guys have any suggestions on what might cause that or anything like that, that'd be awesome if you could let me know. See if I can fix it before anything gets worse. <laughs> Um, and just doing a little update on some stuff. My allergy is getting a little bad over back in this wall here and up in here. Um, I had, I had just did a water test and, um, my pH was, from what I could tell from the color chart, I have this API test kit stuff so I know I'm probably way down the road for better test kits but I can't really afford it um, but my pH was 8.0 I don't know if that's bad or good or in the middle um, and my D DKH or carbonate hardness was uh, what was it um, I think it was 10 or 11 DKH. Um, if you guys could tell me if that's good or bad, that'd be awesome. Uh, but other than that, my tank's algae looks like a problem to me. And I know I need to get some, uh, some more snails and stuff like that, but I was wondering if you guys could recommend any places other than, um, reef scavengers or reef cleaners. Um, I think it's Reef Scavengers is the one that the guy was, uh, cheated a bunch of people, so I heard not to do that one, and Reef Cleaners, I had some problems last time, but I just wanted to see what else is out there to see if I could, if I need to go back to him or not, um, he's a really nice guy, I just gotta, I just wanna see what else is out there, so if you guys have any other recommendations and, um, stuff other than Dr. Foster and Smith because I went there and they're crazy expensive but uh, yeah any suggestions would be awesome um, just wanted to show you guys my uh, mangrove look at that sucker that thing's growing like crazy both of them are doing pretty good but that one's just rocking it out uh, Fish is doing fine, he swims all day and does crap. Uh, I have some starfish in there. I don't know if you can see him, yeah, he's right there. I got three of them in there and they all just go crazy whenever I feed the tank. But, uh, yeah, not much else is going on. Haven't really looked down in the sump in a while, a couple days or so, other than changing my skimmer. The skimmer's still rocking it out, doing an awesome job. Um, hang on a second. Let me move my test kit here a little bit so I can open the other door. Let's see. Not not too big of a problem. I I got some of the um, uh, algae off the rock here. Just pulled it off and see what I could get off. And uh, I got a little bit off there. It doesn't look too bad right now. And I kind of cleaned the walls down a little bit. Um, I don't know if you guys can see that. But there's like an air pocket up here. Here, let's turn it to the side. Yeah. A little air pocket up in the thing. And I don't, I don't know how to fix that. <laughs> and over there, my those things are tumbling like crazy like they should. I don't... I guess everything's doing all right, but if you could, just let me know. Um, but yeah, that's that's my update. So uh, yeah, just hit me back as soon as you guys can, and I appreciate everything you guys do for me. Thanks a lot.